Hey, it wasn't like this when we grew up, Bill. You know, they say for every action, there's a reaction. In fact, I think it was Sir Isaac Newton who said something like that. And the student reaction to an action-filled science hip-hop concert about Newton's laws of motion was very positive. Are you guys okay with us sending Miss Canada here into this huge parade? Why? Why is an Okoe middle school teacher seated in a hover chair headed for an inevitable collision with a giant cream pie? It's part of a live, professionally staged multimedia hip-hop concert illustrating Newton's laws of motion. Do the students learn any science from this? I learned the laws of motion and that science can really be fun. Those dancers are cool and all the entertainment is fun. I think they learned more and, and not only Newton's laws of motion, but if anything, if we sparked a kid's imagination or curiosity today and those students were wondering what they want to be when they grow up, science-related fields, math-related fields, that's where our future is. The show is called FMA Live for force equals mass times acceleration and is fully funded by Honeywell and NASA. A 10-person crew, including three singers and dancers, spend a full day assembling the stage and then entertain and educate kids with skits including sumo wrestling teachers. We start with the two teachers really close to each other. And, you know, he has his mass, the teacher himself. He's mass. Gives a small bump. He doesn't have enough force with just his mass. So we add acceleration, and that visual is backing the teacher up a few feet. And then as he accelerates his mass towards another teacher, he creates a greater force. And the winner is the Blue Blue! All the stunts are designed to capture the attention of middle schoolers and make science relevant to their lives. And this award-winning show, now on its fifth nationwide tour, may have given some Okoe students ideas about a scientific career. If we can just excite one of these students so that there are next astronauts or engineers or chemists, that we did our job today. And it certainly got our attention. Now, the program is the latest in teacher Jason Robinson's association with NASA. He's one of the agency's solar system ambassadors, and he's gearing up for his summer slamming science camp at Lee University. Should be a fun summer, Cindy. Sounds terrific, David. Thanks. And that is a cool school.